Hi, so today I'm going to teach you the right way to embed video on your blog. So the first thing you want to do is in YouTube, you want to go to your video manager so you can find which video you want out of all your videos. And I'm already on the right page. I have about 300 uploads. So I want to embed this one app to capture every photo and every video from every guest. So you're going to click on the video. You're going to click on share and then do your wedding guests give you that awesome? Very cool. So then you're going to click on embed. Now you can just put in the link, but what you want to do is use the embed code. And here's why. Uh, when you use the link, it defaults to showing suggested videos when the video finishes. So, you know, like let's say um, you're a photographer. It's going to show suggested videos of other photographers. You don't want that. So you want to use the embed code instead of the link and um, that's called an iframe and you'll see if you're really geeky you'll see in here where it says rel equals zero that's the related videos it's not going to show them so we're going to grab the embed code and then when you get over to your blog you want to go into the text tab and just paste it um, and then if you want to see a preview of it, let's just make a test of embed code post, save draft. You have to put the title in before to let you preview it. And then you'll notice, oh, sometimes it shows up right away, sometimes it doesn't. In this case, it's wider than what I needed. So what you can do is go into the embed code and you can actually change the size that you want the video to be. So you can make it 560 if you want and then it would show up correctly. Another place that you can put this embed code is on your wedding wire storefront if you're a vendor. So what you're gonna do you go to your storefront scroll down and you see where it says videos you're gonna go to edit embed videos and this is ugly <laughs> it's very ugly but you're just gonna paste in so if you have a new one you're gonna paste it right at the top um, and again pay attention to the maximum width you're just gonna paste in the code so like we did copy and paste you just paste in new code right here that's it